Today is a very, very important day. We're getting water, hopefully. We're gonna drill a hole in the earth so deep, could be 50 feet deep, could be a thousand feet deep. But today we will drill until we find water. All right guys, I'm gonna teach you something today that I learned recently that I probably should have learned a long, long time ago. We're gonna talk about water. Did you know that our earth, our world is made up of 71% water? Yeah. You knew that? Did you know that? No. There's actually way more water than just the oceans and rivers and lakes because there's a different type of water. Do you know what that water is? What? It's underground? It's under the ground. It's called groundwater. Pretty much everywhere you stand, there's just water under the ground. Is that crazy? <laughs> so for our new house, we don't have any rivers or lakes and we don't have city water. So the only way for us to get water in our new house is to find the water that's under the ground. Finding water is incredibly important for us right now because if we do not find water, everything is blocked. We called the city to see if we could get connected to city water because that would be way more convenient, faster to do. That was not an option. The city water does not reach our land. We're gonna do a little experiment. Now, I'm not Bill Nye the science guy, so don't get too excited here. <laughs> but this is our land. There are many different layers of earth. There's different kinds of dirt and rocks, right? And then comes this bad guy. This is what we call clay. We might have some more sand. Maybe a little more rocks. It's raining, it's raining. Some water? Okay, look. You can see the water starting to fill up. It's having a hard time getting around this clay, but it's starting to get a few of the cracks and it's seeping down. That clay is the worst. We have been told that underneath our property, there's lots of clay. It might all be clay. And if it's clay, the clay does not hold water very good, does it? So you can see this is called the water table. This is where the water comes up. But on top, it looks dry. It's like there's no water in there. So what we have to do is we have to go down and dig a hole. And once we dig a hole, then we stick a pump down there. We start pumping. Oh, we have sand in our thing. We gotta, oh, we start getting our water. We're pumping it out of the ground. This is our clean, delicious water. That's how we're gonna get water from now on. Wow. So what happens though if it's all clay? And there's no more water. And there's no water and we're not gonna have water. That would be bad, bad news. This is our option. The well so, is our only option. This is the day. We are gonna drill a well. We find good water. We can take the next step. We can build. So. Big day. Big, big day to find water. This is my fingers crossed. Can you do all four? Because I can very quickly. We should just be praying. It should be praying. Pray for water. All right, guys, I'm just pulling up to the property and look at this approach. It looks so good. I could pull right up on our land if I wanted to. I just wanted to get your final guess before the drill rig comes how deep the well is going to be. How deep is it going to be? No. I think it's going to be. 110 feet. Wow, that'd be great. I'm gonna go 250. Oh, I think it might be him. All right, I gotta go, love ya. Exciting day. I want you to all guess in the comments below how deep do you think this well is going to be? Is it going to be 100 feet, 200 feet, 300 feet, 400 feet, 500 feet? Don't look at the end of this video. You got to guess right now and then you'll see if you're right at the end. We are about one hour into drilling. I'd say we've probably drilled. 60 to 80 feet, something like that. I'm trying to count how many times the thing goes up and down and they put a new thing down. No signs of water yet, although some things are changing. I think they just put the casing in. The moment of truth for Herb. Will we hit water at 100 feet? We are about to find out because we are right at the point.
just hit some water at 160 feet. Super exciting. I don't know how much water it is yet. They they're, said they gotta test the water and kind of clean it up for a second to see if it's good water. There she is. The results are in. The well is dug. We did it. We didn't. Yeah, the drillers did it. Thank you, driller guys. And we have some very exciting news to share. First, we're gonna show this video. The video that you are seeing right now is a test being done on our well. And how much water did we get, Ash? Do you want me to say the exact number? Sure. Is it 21? 0 0.5. 21.5 gallons per minute, which is How about that? Perfect. Think I about mean, 21 and a half milk cartons just being thrown at you every minute. That's all of our water we're gonna be able to take showers with and We're so drink. grateful that was, and more importantly, only 160 feet deep. Which means we get some money back from our deposit. Yeah, like half of it. So we can buy something else cool for the land. <laughs> so or just save it, I don't know. So the Crosby's have water. We can now take the next step. Plans. House plans? House plans. Designing the house. And as a final call out, to our boy Herb, we want to say thanks to Herb for telling us where to dig the well. He turned out to be right. My skepticism on well witches is slightly less. We decided we wanted to call them well water diviners. Water diviners sounds I better like than well better. witches. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. We're so so honestly so grateful to have water. Cannot believe that it's done. And we just feel incredibly incredibly blessed and 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 happy that we have the result that we have. So thank you everyone for following the water journey. Next step, house plans. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I mean, we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye. Wait, I have something to say. Okay. Knock, knock. Uh, who's there? Oh my gosh, hang on. I, I don't... <laughs> you didn't have anything? You're just going to make it up on the spot? <laughs> no, I do. I just don't remember. <laughs> it was so funny because Claire just told it to me. No, no, no. Okay, I got it. <laughs> okay. Knock, knock. Who's there? Owl says. Owl says who?